Hey guys, it's Stephanie here. Just wanted to do a quick Facebook video for y'all. Uh, a thank you and appreciate all the birthday wishes I received today. In keeping up with the annual tradition of opening sports cards, because I enjoy sports cards, that's what I'm going to do for y'all today. This is the third year in, the, uh, in a row that I'm doing this uh, to showcase some of the cards that I got this past year and showcase something that you know that I actually got in last year's box opening that I did. So again, thank you all. Appreciate all the love and support and uh, let's just get into it. I tried a couple ways to do this video of me facing the camera and it didn't quite out work, work out so well. So I'm just gonna go along with it this way because I did about three takes already. So here we go. First up that I got this card most recently what is a, of course, since I'm an Eagles fan, a Jalen Hurts Refractor. I bought this at a card show. So that is a rookie card of Jalen Hurts. All the optimism in the world this year for the Eagles, but not a lot of expectation. So hopefully this kid does good on the field. And yes, that's right. I called him a kid because I am getting older and older every day. But it's a positive thing, right? Okay, here we go. Next up is something I got graded this year. It's a Devonta Silver, uh, Devonta Graham Silver Refractor 8.5, graded by Beckett. Another nice card that I got. I thought it was going to grade higher to 9, but what are you going to do? It got an 8.5. I plan to sell this because he just got traded to a different team, so hopefully he has a good season and I could profit from that one. Next up that I got graded this past year was this awesome Travis Kelsey Refractor rookie card. I didn't pay a lot of money for this, and uh, I'm very happy that this is one of those cards that you get when it first comes out and it turned out to be something. So this got a grade of a 9.5 from Beckett. So I truly enjoy that card, and it's worth a couple hundred dollars. Uh, nothing too outrageous, but by the time he retires, I'm sure it'll be worth more than that. Next up, um, I finally have made progress toward completing my 1986-87 Fleer basketball set. Now, for those of you know who know me well, it is the ultimate set for me to collect. I've been collecting this set since I've been in high school. I used to buy packs and in try to get the Michael Jordan rookie. Now, unfortunately, it's been the elusive card for me for many years, but I'm well on my way, and hopefully one of these days I'll be able to afford it. But in the meantime, I got some of my cards from the set graded this year, courtesy of Victor and Keita, and uh, got a nice graded Clyde Drexler 7 rookie. A Magic Johnson second year sticker card, which is a five. My favorite player, basketball player of all time, well, at least top two, Charles Barkley. Nice eight. This is his rookie card from PSA. Larry the Legend, Larry Bird, also an eight from PSA. Hakeem the Dream, Hakeem, Hakeem Olajuwon, nice eight rookie to go with my set. And then some two surprising, really nice cards grade-wise, because they grade out of 10 for those of you who are, not, who are not familiar. I got a Julius Irving. They graded mine a 10, or a 9, I'm sorry, as well as a Magic Johnson, which they also graded a 9. Now, I would say it's between Magic and Barkley as my two favorite players, because I used to have posters of them in our room. So, Magic and Barkley. So, that's a 9. But this is a second-year Magic Johnson card. Next up, another surprise card that I got, Jalen Brown. He's on the Celtics. He had a really great season for the Celtics this year, so that's why I got this card graded, and it graded it out at a perfect 10, which is amazing. Perfect 10 for this card. Silver Prism. This is the best or one of the most desirable rookies of Jalen Brown, and like I said, it was a surprise for me. It's rarely rare to get a 10, and I will take it. Um, I'd say it's around a thousand, a thousand dollars, nine hundred to a thousand, uh, right now, current market. So hopefully it goes up during the season, and this is a card that I will be selling. So nice card and a very su surprise 
uh, pickup. Next up is a card that I got last year while opening boxes. And this is, a, at the time, I didn't know how rare it was, but indeed it is super, super rare. It's a short print of this guy here, Erling Holland. It's, he is the hottest soccer rookie probably in the world, or one of, if not the hottest soccer player uh, in the world. Um, and this one here, it's a, like I said, it's a yellow, it's the yellow refractor version, not the base version. For those of you who are unfamiliar, it's a, like I said, it's a super short print. Uh, so I didn't even realize it when I got it last year opening the box. So I had this graded and uh, like I said, this is my best find of the year last year. So uh, right now value is probably uh, maybe, a, maybe a thousand. Or more, probably maybe up to maybe up to fifteen, sixteen hundred at the highest. It's a nine. It didn't grade a ten, which is okay. It's still a super rare card. So next up, I'm going to do my annual box break. So 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 it begins. Hopefully, I get a Holland in this box or this guy Messi. It's uh, always a positive thing if you get a Messi, maybe a Messi autograph. Uh, then we got. Uh, Joao Felix is on there and uh, yeah so anyway uh, the the value on this this is my best box that I bought this year I bought this early in the year and I invested into it 690 so about $700 uh, I always try to write the price on the back so I know how much I paid for something and then I track the value over the year this is the 20 uh, 2019 2020 uh, UEF Champions League and uh, this has it went up in value to about a thousand dollars so for my super awesome break today I'm gonna open up a box that's worth a thousand dollars and I'm looking to get Holland cards or uh, some other rookie cards as well as I see them and open them I will call it out so I got some trusty sleeves and here we go I'm gonna gonna break the seal of the box and start the opening so here we go hopefully I get a good rookie like I said or perhaps I'll get a Pulisic who's one of the great American soccer players I don't know that's the fun and enjoyment you have when you open boxes so all right what I always do as also part of the tradition is I keep a pack so that when I put a pack aside, I should say. So I'm gonna hold this particular pack until when I tell my 50th birthday. So I'm gonna do a super break on my 50th birthday of all these products. So maybe that might go up to who knows how much in value. So hopefully a good amount. So here we go. Let's hope we get some good, good colors, some good autographs. A little box for my wrappers here. Looks like we have some color to begin with here. Uh, oh yeah, here we go. Here's a refractor from, has a little bit of a sheen to it, Sergio Aguayo. Here's another refractor here of Tammy Abraham. And then another base. So I'll put the base aside here and I'll put these in sleeves. So I don't ruin them. And if there's any that are worth uh, getting graded for next year we'll cross our fingers and maybe we'll have another Holland victory in terms of value because that's kind of the goal to get to get value out of your pack opening <clears throat> here we go this guy's a po he's a, a Polish uh, superstar actually uh artem dusbaya i think he's polish i'm pretty sure it doesn't say on here but i'm pretty sure he's a polish player and this is cool because this one is limited to only i don't know if the camera will pick it up 25 so that's a super rare card right there a dusbaya a dusbaya Cool. Oh, I see 
a good card on the back here. Uh, base, Raheem Sterling. It's a base, but still nice. He's a good player. There's Vive D and Trent Alexander-Arnold. I have a lot of cards of Trent Alexander-Arnold. Sleeve. It's not numbered. And uh, Sadio Main. It's the other base. I'm going to post this video up on YouTube too. I do this more or less, you know, like I said, as a thank you, but I also do this as, a, as kind of a recording memory of what I get in cards when I open them. Ooh, uh, we got some uh, trip, Trippier. Here's a refractor of Leon Bailey. It's kind of a cool bubble effect refractor. Base card of him as well. And Alexandro base. So that's kind of cool. It's a neat effect on a card. Nice little bubbly effect. It's not numbered. Very nice. Come on, Messi. Let's see what we got here. Uh, Douglas Santos. It's a refractor. Here's a good player. This is numbered out of 250. Luka Modric. It's a good card. So I got a nice refractor and numbered card out of Luka Modric. He plays for uh, Real Madrid. Oh, the, the highlight rookie in this is Fati. An Ansu Fati is the is the rookie that you want to get in this product. That's why the boxes are so expensive. So let's let's hope let's oh I see a good one on the back. Uh, we got Forsberg. Uh, Lucas Herdrecki refractor. This guy's a really good player. K. Havertz. I have a lot of his cards as well. I've has I've have his rookie card. And Polisic, I think I mentioned him earlier. I'm going to put him in a sleeve, too. He's one of the best American players. He plays on Chelsea. And, hey, and this gentleman here, Havertz, hey, is, I mean, he's just a kid, but he uh, he's a, I have his rookie, so that's, that's a cool card to get. Hmm. We haven't got any autographs yet, so still hope to get a messy autograph. That would be wild. Kotia. Niguez. Oh, I did. I got my first autograph here. Niguez. And the autograph is Zen Zenchenko. Zenchenko. Not numbered. He is he plans for Manchester City. Zenchenko. And then Timo Werner. He's a really good player. I have a lot of his cards, too. Timo Werner. I just want to grab and see, see that. Not. Okay. Oh, here we go. This is a good one here. Okay. PZ. And green. Holland. Yes, this is not numbered but that is a green refractor nice and then two base cards so this one here i could look up the value on that might be something to get graded that's green anytime you have a color variation of a card it's better than a base version and with Topps products, they call it refractors. So it's a green refractor. So we're just warming up, hopefully. Here's another Disbaya. Purple. Purple. Not numbered. 
And then uh, I'll show off Griezmann. He plays for Barcelona, another one of the top players in the world, Antonio Griezmann or Antoine. Very, he's a really good player. So I got some Desvias, Colin Green. I think we need a Messi. Come on, Messi. Ah, I called it. Ha <laughs> ha, even though it's just a base card, that's still good, cool. And Mbappe, Refractor, good card. Another one of the best players in the world. So I called it. I mean, I wish it was a super Refractor, but I will take the Mbappe Refractor and Messi Base. I've actually seen some of his shoes in person. He has really small feet, which is surprising. I don't know. I don't know if it says how tall he is on here, but yeah, he's only five foot seven. So you know that means he's probably five five <laughs> or five four. But he has really small feet because his shoes are like smaller than mine. Uh, okay. Don't know. Here, here's a Wang. Chin Wang, that's a refractor. Here's a Neymar, like a uh, another refractor. Neymar's a good player. I'll just mention Silva. He's a good player too, but that's just a base. But this cool bubble type card of Neymar. And then this guy here, who plays for Salzburg, which is actually the team that Holland played for before he he's uh, playing for uh, Bortmond currently. Okay. Here's a Silicon purple. Another uh, Neymar base and Hussan Aguirre. So we got a purple out of that. This one's numbered out of 250. Okay, moving right along. One of the best goalkeepers, Hugo Lori. Plays on the French national team. Kang Lee, base. Uh, Luca Modric, blue. And Gian Oblak. So we need some more sleeves here. base. We only have a few packs left, so we we'll still do another autograph unless it's in that pack that I selected to keep out, or Harry Kane, probably one of the best players for England, Douglas Santos Green. So, it's a good base, and then green. Santos. Okay. Three more packs. V V D. Stegen or Stegen. That's a fractor. Uh, Another refractor and Bernard. Okay, two more packs. Okay, come on, big card. Verena is one of my favorite players. 
but not anything super exciting. Gareth Bale and Luka Modric. Luka Modric's probably, again, like I keep saying this for every player, but he's probably one of the best. There's and last pack mojo. So if I don't get an autograph in this one, I know that my autograph is going to be in that pack, the mystery pack. So I almost want to open that one, but I will hold on. The excitement. Uh, Abo Dalio. Hengmin Sun and Kyle Walker. So I did not get two autographs. There's a Jaden Sancho. I think he's a good player too. Um, I did not get two autographs, so perhaps it's in that one. It's never guaranteed, but I have to say that I'm very happy with the Holland. This is the best card in the in the box and i'd like to thank y'all 